Hello everybody, here's Anne Christiansen. Today I'm here with Shashti Forsberg from Sweden. And your story is very unique. You danced Nia for many, many years, correct? Yes, I did. I, I've danced since the year 2000. And very stubborn, only to be a student. I was very convinced that I was never going to teach. Um, so yes, I've been a student for many years. So, so what was the moment in your in your being when you said, "I also want to be a Nia teacher and share the joy with others"? Can you describe it for us? I think something happened during Brown Belt. There was this huge urge to go back to the roots and really wanting to dive into the music and learning about the bars. So I retook uh, the white belt after that. And that was really when I, when I felt that, yes, I also want to share. Mm -hmm. uh, I cannot exactly, I've, you know, I've tried to analyze what actually happened, but <laughs> it's really just, there was this urge to do it. And I think I've been talking to quite a few people our age, uh, saying that maybe at this age we seek a new meaning to life, because the normal work life is, it's just, it's going on, it's been there forever. Uh, my children are grown up, flown out of the nest, and all of a sudden, teaching Nia has given me a, a, a new purpose, uh, which is absolutely fantastic. Oh, wow. Yes, what you describe is true in many of us. At a certain age, you also have a story to tell. And when we have found that joy and meaning to pass it on to others, that is very delightful. And I do know that your professional life demands a lot of you. And, uh, and uh, how good to have Nia as a sanctuary. And now, coming from being al already a brown belt and retakes of belts, You chose to be part of the online green belt. How has that been for you? It's been fantastic, to be honest. Uh, I didn't know what to expect because, I mean, I think many of us who have taken the belts in the at the physical at the doyo or in any studio, and it's it's such a treat being there for the entire week, going into the bubble. So I, I didn't really know what to expect. Uh, but the online belt going on and on uh, week after week has given it. It's really it's been it's becoming such a big part of my life. Uh, and and as you say, my my ordinary work life, my professional life is quite hectic. Uh, and, and Nia for me has always been both dancing, but also a, a sort of leadership training, really, in, in my professional life. And now, during the online belt, I am playing with the different things we learn each week. Also, at work, uh, on the dance floor, but also at work. So that has been a, a treat, being, being so present in the belt week after week after week. Uh, I think that's the, the biggest difference. Oh, wow. I'm loving what you're describing. So there's a sense of the green belt philosophies coming with you and being applied in your daily life. And uh, can you pinpoint the, the if you see it already now, we still have three weeks to, on, to go on this fantastic green belt something you have gained for your near near teacher also perhaps teaching online or seeing that as a part of your way of sharing Nia? I think the, the biggest thing so far in the green belt is really uh, I see it as a as a belt of the art of listening uh, I've become a much more I think confident is the word confident listener that I can trust what I listen, uh, the music, also myself cueing, listening to, to the students, uh, maybe even in a way of, of listening with my eyes, what are their bodies saying uh, when we do different things. So I th it's really my ears are this big. <laughs> 
uh, and have become much bigger during these weeks. Yeah. Well, thank you. That is a big pearl uh, to hear the listening with eyes and ears and, and being in a confident place. I always speak about the Green Belt as a station to come any time during your NIA career, even only as a student and perhaps being a teacher, of course, for all teachers. And I'm very grateful for uh, how it has evolved into this online format and that it is very consumable and also we can integrate it in our life with more ease. So thank you for those uh, wise words, Shashti. And if someone is watching this who's thinking, nah, I don't like online, I want it to be in real, um, and I'm going to wait, which we all will do. We will retake whatever we did online once again, for sure, when we can do it in real. But um, what would you give to someone who's thinking, ah, is online for me or not? I would say, <laughs> just do it. Uh, <laughs> because as I said, it's really, I mean, I'm also in all these Zoom meetings every day, as we all are, uh, and, and yeah, was a bit, is, is this really going to work? But it does, uh, and your energy and your commitment to sharing your knowledge shows also through the screen. So I'm, I'm just grateful. Well, thank you very much for uh, your kind words. And I look forward to seeing you in our live stream when we continue the Green Belt. Thank you, Shashti. It was nice to speak with you. Thank you.